Hello, this is David at WoodlandsComputerGeeks.com and today we're going to show you how to delete items from your start menu. If your computer is slow on startup or when you reboot or when you log into Windows, if it seems like it takes forever for it to finally get calmed down and the hourglass goes away to where you can start working, a lot of times it's a simple problem of having too many programs in your startup menu. What that will do is like when you load software, say Adobe Acrobat, uh, HP printing software, anytime you buy like a piece of hardware or something and you install it, what it does is it goes and puts a item in your start menu which starts up when your computer starts and this can really drag on your computer. AOL is one thing too or any of these messaging programs like uh, AIM or MSN or Skype if you have those checked to start on startup it will take your computer a lot longer because it's trying to connect that program to the internet. So anyway a real quick way to do it is just go to start programs. This is Windows XP classic menu once again it's what I work in. Now if you go to programs here you'll see a menu that says startup. As you can see the only thing I have in is task manager. And that's normally the only thing I have other than a print screen program sometimes that I put in startup. Uh, that way my system is a lot quicker. So if you go to startup and you see over here where this task manager is, if you see like five or six or seven items there, you're, that's probably causing a lot of the problem. So you need to make sure that you don't want them in startup, first of all. Uh, some people may prefer them. I always like to run these programs on my own once Windows gets up and I need it. Uh, but uh, this is where they will be. All you got to do is get it highlighted over there, right click on it and hit delete and that'll get rid of it and it won't start up the startup okay that's the easy way uh, let me show you if you have multiple profiles where different people log on well they're all going to have these probably in their startup so you need to go to start programs accessories well let's do it this way settings taskbar and start menu. Click on the start menu tab and I have this set to classic menu not start menu the top one so I have it set to classic menu. We want to go to customize then we want to go to the advanced tab And that's going to bring up a Windows Explorer session. So what it's going to do is it's going to highlight, take you right to the start menu where it's highlighted here. And you can see you got start menu, expand program files. Down here you got startup. And that's where it's putting them. And you can see the task manager over here on the right side. That's what's telling it startup. Now this is under this profile right here that starts with a D. So if you want to make sure it doesn't do it for all users, you want to expand all users, start menu, programs, startup. And it's the same thing here. Now you can right click it and delete it from here. And you can also add new things in your start menu from here. I think I showed that on another video. So you want to delete it from that menu too. And also you can go through, it if you have several profiles, you have a couple kids or a spouse or something that has a profile on here, you'll need to go through all the pro individual profiles and do that. And that's basically all you need to do and that'll help your system performance on startup and it won't be so slow all the time. Anyway, till next time, thanks for stopping by.